everybody. That's my fantasy voice. And I'm using my fantasy voice today because today we're playing Skyrim. Anniversary edition on the PlayStation 5. Survival mode! Hello, Rosie. You alright? <laughs> <laughs> alright? <laughs> you alright, mate? <laughs> yeah. I couldn't have ruined that epic intro. Hello, yeah. everyone. It's me. Ah, oh, I I'm so looking forward to this, Rosie. We missed Skyrim's birthday last week. Yes, we did. Because I was ill. I was poorly. Poorly, Rob. But you're um, not poorly anymore. No, just a little bit. But mostly fine. <laughs> um, well enough to come in for a belated Skyrim happy birthday anniversary stream. Um, Skyrim Anniversary Edition is out now on PS5 and PS4. We're playing on PS5. One of the things that is bundled in with the Anniversary Edition, Rosie, mm-hmm. is Survival Mode, which Woo! I did play for a little bit last year, but only once. So I thought I'd just start it again. Also, excitingly, on the PS5 version, it doesn't duplicate the trophies, and so I can get the platinum one oh, all over right. again. All <laughs> right, okay, I see how it is. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Well, no, I haven't duplicated it. Fair, yeah, if you, if you get it. them again, then that's fair, because, I'm you know, you put the work it into again. it. Um, but I've done the opening, the famous opening. You're finally awake. Oh, you're finally awake. Done all that. I've come outside for the first time. It's given me the prompt, would you like to enable survival mode? And I have said, yes, please. Yeah. And so I'm excited because, as you know, I don't know anything about this. So we're coming from the perspective of Rob, yeah. who knows everything about this game. And myself. Well, not everything. Pretty much everything. Not everything. And then myself, who knows, like, you know, not a lot about it. So I'm excited to see, especially survival mode for the first time. Oh, no. Oh, no. It's just started already. Immediately, you're, you're hungry. Hungry, which reduces your total available stamina, represented by a dark region in the stamina bar. Hunger also affects how quickly you can attack with weapons. Eat food to reduce your hunger. Cooked meals are significantly better at restoring hunger than raw, uncooked food. Eating raw meat may lead to contracting food poisoning. Okay, Ooh. so I've picked up some food in the opening dungeon. I have got some mead, some bread, and two cabbages. Oh, you can have a cabbage sandwich and a drink. I don't need a drink. Restores two points of hunger. I have some bread for now, oh. I reckon. Best bread in video games is yak as a yak like a dragon. Yeah, look at that. You feel better and are now satisfied. Um, so in survival mode, you have to sleep. You have to eat. Mm-hmm. Um, you have to pay attention to whether you're warm or cold. Ooh. Um, you can only level up whilst you sleep, I think. Whereas in normal Skyrim, you can level up wherever. Well, that's um, exciting. One of the things that is also bundled in with Anniversary Edition is a camping set, which isn't available in regular Skyrim, but is like a it's a community creation. Um, like a mod. It's a mod. Um, so the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to try and craft myself a camping set so I can set up camp anywhere in the wilderness. Okay. Which will give me a little fire to cook on and stay warm. Um, also, fishing is new. Uh, fishing! I'd like to go fishing. Obviously, great for survival mode. Catch some fish. Cook the fish. Eat and be healthy. And be happy. I can never resist... I can never resist discovering this standing stone right at the beginning of Skyrim. I love how there's like a dedicated path to it and you're like, nope, I'm going to fall down the rocks. A guardian stone is discovered. Probably quickly stays. Well, hello to everyone in the chat and hello to our, first of all, our lovely mods. We are being modded by Domino and Oliver Bath as well as Alex who's on the PlayStation Access account who got a bit spooked earlier because Ash also went into PlayStation Access account and started being a spooky ghost. But it's fine. Alex knows now. Um, but hello, Throbbing Uncle. Hello, oh, <laughs> Fernando. Hello, Troy Green. Hello, Ryan. Hello, Seldom Sleeper. Uncle. Hello, Dream of Dragons. Hello, Sarah without the H. Hello, Kieran J. Hello, Jeff Stanley. Honey Bunch. Hello, hello <laughs> to you all. And hello Nathan. to you all. Hello, everyone. Um, so, Rosie, I've also got some other mods added. So okay. right now, trophies are disabled because when you enable mods, it disables trophies. Oh, okay. So this isn't a trophy one run currently, but one of the mods I've got on is improved weather and water. Oh, um, of course. Oh, look at it. 
It's just glorious, isn't it? It does look very twinkly. I mean, this is a, don't forget, a PS3 game, technically. Yeah, it, yeah, definitely. So the first thing I need to do, really, I don't want to be, I think there's, that's a mine with some bandits up there. Um, everything's a little bit harder in survival mode as well. So we want to be careful. There's some fish up here. Now, I could fish the new way, but I don't have a fishing rod yet, and uh, there isn't a fishing point here. So I'm going to fish the classic way. What, just, what did you just catch? Like a bear! Jump in. Like a bear! Like a bear! <sighs> Go on, jump in and get it. If you jump in, will you die? No. Oh, you just, just jump on in. Swim in the waterfall. Fatigue. Oh. oh, God. Already. Oh, God. I'm going down the water. <laughs> ah! <laughs> That's okay. enough adventure for one I day. Did not, I did not go to plan. I failed to catch any fish. Sword in the Storm says, I've never touched Skyrim. Well, pretty much you and me both. Apart from, I mean, I, I, I played a smidgen of it on the channel. And then I oh, did please. the intro, got lost. Please and then catch the fish. Got killed by spiders. Oh, am I not close enough? Catch them! Oh. I nearly got one. So when you were saying earlier, you have to think of your hot or cold. Is there like a like you know a time weather system in this game, or you mean is like it like a day night cycle? Yeah, yeah, or like you know a season cycle as well. Yes, well, it's not a season cycle, but there you know there's the north, which is very cold. For God's sake. I just try looking for some other food. Some easier to catch fish. Easier to There's catch. There's one. Did Got you one. get it? A brook bass. Ooh. Another one. Look at them all. <laughs> Sorry, Benny, but that's it. We're going to be fine in survival Can't mode. Can't them raw, but once I get a campfire going or any other fire, I'll cook them up nicely. You can eat fish raw, can't you? You can, but... It just said on the game that if you do that, you're more likely to get food poisoning. So it's better to cook them. What's this? Ooh. Harvest some, some a slaughter fish egg nest. Oh, poor slaughter fish. They were going to grow up to be beautiful fish. Well, now they're going to be caviar for me. No, the fishes. David Maxwell says Rob Skyrim Pearson. That's right. The S is so versatile, isn't it? It can stand for literally anything. I feel, I feel that we should say as well. So um, obviously we didn't stream this on Skyrim's birthday as Rob was ill, but we kept on saying in the office that basically Ash and I were going to play Skyrim and you should have seen Rob's face. It was absolutely destroyed. I've never seen Rob be more destroyed in life than he did when we said <laughs> Skyrim's birthday, we're going to play it and you're not. <laughs> That would have been very sad. This is Riverwood, so I found my way to Riverwood. Is this the one with the chicken in it, where if you yeah, attack it? Yeah, there it is. There's the chicken. Kill should. that chicken, and everyone will come after me. What? What is it now? Royal it? chicken. It was as big as the mountain and black as night. It, it flew right over what the barrel. What is it, woman? <laughs> jelly filled, jelly filled panda says Rob like Smelly Pearson, and uh, I just like how <laughs> silly that is. Every day we get visitors oh, I've seen this blacksmith. I think you've speak, spoken about him yeah. in the Friday feature. He a lot. died in my old game. That was a it. A dragon attacked Riverwood, and the dragon killed him. And no. It was devastating. See no harm in it, if you have the skill. I do. I do. The grindstone have the skill. will improve your weapons. Use the table to improve your armor. I know. If you've got the raw materials, you can use the forge to make something new. So, with survivor mode, is your goal still to uh, beat, like, the main story sorry. of the game? Sorry, Rosie. Someone is... People in the chat have to have subtitles. Always forget. Have to have subtitles. Wah, has to be wah, there! Wah. Yeah, so your, so, your, so your objective in survival mode is still to play the game. You've yeah. just got the survival just elements got, to it. You no, know, lots of other things. Camping? How do I... I've heard that you can make a camping set... Should have known it wouldn't be as easy as just going up to here and using a forge. Andrew Johnson says, Riverwood vibes makes this game look so cozy, like a warm blanket after a long day. Ah, oh, yes. I could do it. I love, literally, every time I've been going home, I've just been coated in blankets. Oh, fishing rod. Yeah, I need an iron ingot and some firewood. I can get firewood around here. Anyone know how to make the, the camping equipment? Uh, Anyone in the chat? How do I make a couple, the a couple of bangs on the on the table and then you're done. No, I jewelry studded leather jewelry miscellaneous. I mean that's where it should be, right? 
in there. Maybe can you not do it in Riverwood? Maybe it's like you have to do it in another town. Well, it should be at any fort. You should just be able to craft it. I don't know why I'm suggesting, like, you know me, I know very little about this game. Hello, lady. All Goodbye, right. lady. I can get some firewood from here, though. Uh, Benjamin says, Rob, you need three firewood and one leather for camping. No, but it wasn't even giving me the option to craft it. It wasn't even greyed out. And then Stakeholders says, it's in the miscellaneous. It wasn't. They've literally just seen that it wasn't there. <laughs> I just looked in miscellaneous. Where's the axe? Where's my fire chopping axe? I can't even... Where's can't even. anything? That's survival mode. They're like, you have no axe. Where's the axe? It's, I swear, it's just literally here, isn't it? Ryan Clare says, maybe you there? need to buy it. Maybe you need to... Can, do you get, like, recipes in Skyrim? I'm going to starve in a minute. Where's your, a, where's I your want hunger? some firewood. I want some firewood, but I need an axe to chop some firewood. I swear the axe is usually just lying around here. Uh, Lost One says, I saw it in Misk. Am I going insane? We looked in Misk, didn't we? I mean, I was reading the chat. Let's go back to the forge. Maybe I am going absolutely mad. And then mad. Macaroni Pete says, you've got to download it from Creation Club, I I've think. I've got it. I've got it. The same as I've, you know, got survival mode as well. Oliver Bath says, just ask someone for it. <laughs> I like it's it. It's not there. Cork bulb arrow, fishing rod, shell bug helmet. You don't need a camping it's site. It's not there. Mist. Sleep in someone's bed. I'm going to have to. Whatever you need. I can't even find the flipping wood chopping axe at the moment. It's not going well. Those are iron, iron ingots there that I could steal. Oh, not from that nice lady. You looking for a new blade? Looking for Fernando says yourself? Rob starving Pearson. Phil uh, Harrison says, well, I guess it's time to start eating the people. <laughs> iron ingot. Oh, I've not got much gold. I can't afford to be spending 22 gold on an iron ingot. He looks very happy right now. He's, he's just, he's, his mouth is just like, I'm so boo. Now mm. we go. He shut it now. I've got the camping thing download. I know I have. I did it before the stream. I don't know how to activate it so I can actually build it. Um, anyway. Who well, it's fine. Andrew like Johnson that. says camping's for noobs anyway. So, can I steal the cabbage? I can take the cabbages. Cabbage soup. That's what I want to make. Um, I need a, a cook, a campfire though, to cook it at. Also, a wood chopping axe. Good luck. So what, do you usually find it there? It's usually just lying around. I never even have to look for it. It's just lying around by all the firewood. There it is. Hey! What do you think up there? Oh, I wish I saw that place. <laughs> it's so lovely. No, no, lady. <laughs> Let's get I some firewood. I need the axe. That lady sounded very young. Is she, you're old enough to hold an axe. Thought he was like, I wish I, I saw know. that first. Yes, David Maxwell. I have platinumed it. But platinuming it doesn't require you to be doing survival mode or camping. So I've never done those things. Okay? Carl Harris says... Thanks for commenting. Carl Harris says, to start the campfire, you need to place a campfire ring located in the magic menu. Does that make sense to you? No. A, a campfire ring. It's in the destruction. No. Pretty sure. Jelly Four Panda says, Rosie of Skyrim, everyone is old enough for an axe. And that's very fair. <laughs> I like how methodical this is, the firewood chopping. <sighs> I love how you find you're like, ah, oh, me while I'm like, <laughs> and then he goes, Rah. there we go. <laughs> Got some firewood. Okay, you can stop now. You can stop now. Stop now. 
So what, do you pick up this log as you chop it? Yeah. Oh, you're carrying too much to be able to run. Oh, for God's sake. Of course, it also, survival mode makes it so you can't carry that much as well. I mean, I've not got much anyway. Let's get rid of the axe. Don't need that. I could sell it, though, to... I'm going to walk slowly over to Alvor, the blacksmith, Ugh, over-encumbered as I am, and I'm going to sell my axe. Why do you want to sell your axe? Because I don't use an axe, and it's heavy, and I could get money for it. That's right. You're the, you're the stealth archer, aren't you? Yeah, and if I do go melee, it's always sword and shield for me. If I was to start this, who would you, rec what, who would you recommend for me? Who? Yeah, like what kind of character? I could be anyone. And they're all very much the same. Hit the chicken. Let oh the God. townspeople go crazy. Please buy my axe. Ah. You looking for a new blade? Take a look. What have I got for sale, you say? I've got... You can have the dagger as well. I've already got a steel dagger. Woodcutter's axe I just picked up. I need that. Apparel, I need all of that. Can Bear your character pelt. walk around without shoes? Come on, sorry. Your character walk around without shoes? Yes. Does it, in what, they don't take, like, you know, it doesn't affect their tiredness or anything like that? Uh, I don't think Or is it, like, part of armor? I'm guessing it's part of armor. Oh, God. So I'm drained. And I'm peckish. Oh, I really need to make some... I really need some soup or something. I like the symbols for being drained. Like, you know, the peckish one with this, the red demon-looking being. That That's is how I trader. feel whenever I'm hungry. Yeah, hangry. Hangry. <laughs> okay, here we go. Here we go. The inn. Oh, this is nice. Are you listening? Hard not to. Yale is going bad. We need to get it. Don't steal. That's naughty. <laughs> Rosie, like my little conscience. conscience. Yeah. <laughs> Don't steal. That's naughty. Can I have some food, please? You're that visitor been poking around. Can I have some food? That's please? not very welcoming. Need a room? Talk to Delphine. Well, that's not. Oh. You know, this isn't a very welcoming person, inn. Food for the hungry. I don't care if it's welcoming or not. It's got food. Well, you know, the first lady's like, oh, you're that stranger who's been poking oh, around our town. That. A baked potato restores 18 oh. points of hunger. Yes, please. Cooked beef restores three. Da, 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 da. Da, 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 Cooked catfish. It's all quite expensive, though. 18 points of hunger for an apple. Grilled chicken breast. Yeah. Fuchsia says, I really upset the landlord in this pub. What did you do? Pedantic Gaming says, Rosie is the Jiminy Cricket of the office. And I really like that. It means I get a little hat. Jiminy Cricket's the name. I need enough, enough money to pay for my bed for the night. Um, I don't want to buy too much, though. I'll just buy a salmon steak for now. Here, take a look at this. Some of the Jarl's men came by and left this bounty letter. Dun -dun -dun. Kill, Kill bandit. bandit. Okay, at home. that's going to be a bit too difficult for me at the moment, I think. We don't get a lot of travelers here in Riverwood. Sure thing. It's yours for a day. I think it's this go. one. Nope. It's been so long. It's what this you, one. What are you trying to do? Find the room that I've just rented for the night. I think. Well, it just said bed owned. Oh, oh they're God. all saying bed owned. Oh, is it? Oh, is it? Someone else owns it. Yeah. Here we go. This is my room. Ah, <sighs> God, not used to being so weak. <laughs> right, let's have something to eat. How does it feel coming back to the beginning of the game? Oh, I as love it. I do love it. Baked potato. Am I still hungry? Roland says the best Skyrim is Skyrim VR. Have you ever tried Skyrim VR? Indeed, I have. Is it good? Uh, yes. It is. It is indeed. It's being inside Skyrim. 
running around your in the world. <laughs> Lewis Price says, this is like Kingdom Come Deliverance meets the Elder Scrolls. And it is a little bit, <laughs> except that it is the Elder Scrolls. Oh, look how hungry I am. I'm going to have to have something nice for breakfast. My name's on Henry. Um, I feel quite hungry. Brook Bass, I need to cook that. Cabbage, green apple, salmon steak. Oh, Still man. peckish? Just restored 220 points of hunger. What are you talking about? <laughs> I ate an entire salmon. If I, like, created some kind of constantly hungry <laughs> wood elf. Oh, what's he doing on the floor? He's just sleeping. Where? There. <laughs> He's just like, well, this is my bed for the night. I can't be stealing food already. I'm going to have to buy some more food. You're the no, do oh, we, if, you, no. if, you, if you're going to steal, then steal. You know, I'm, I'm just, I'm just, I'm here to learn about the ways of Skyrim. I need to find Alvor. Is this him? We got rooms and food. No, Drink not. too. Ike. Let's sate that appetite. Hmm? Yes, let's do that, please. Wakes up immediately and gives you food. Right, I'll buy the hawker loaf then. Fine. I'll buy two of them. Whoa, you're going all out. And one more bit of food. Nick Clement says, I can relate to this wood elf. I'm constantly peckish. I'm going to sell. I'm going to sell the mead. And instead buy some cooked beef. No. Right. Until next time. Could really use a cooking pot to cook my cabbages into cabbage soup. I'm not gonna steal. I am determined. I'm not gonna be a. Th nah, you're you're gonna steal by the end of the stream. No, I won't. You're gonna be like you're gonna start off all noble, and then we're gonna get to the end, and then you're gonna be like, I still don't have a cooking pot, and you're just gonna steal it. That that's well, my prediction. To do something. I said can I no. use your cooking pot? No oh, you can. No theatrics, no thief chasing. Well, what are you going to do then, huh? Let's hear it. Yeah, just said use. That looks pretty good. What they've got in there right now. Cooking pots allow you to cook food that restores your health or provides other temporary effects. Each recipe requires specific culinary ingredients that can be found throughout Skyrim. This? So. Oh. <clears throat> Oh yes, I just need one bit of salt and some cabbage. I think I've only got one salt pile at the moment, so I can only make one batch of cabbage soup. Soup, but look how good it is. Restores 380 points of hunger. I've never had cabbage soup. Like, not just cabbage. I think I've had onion soup in the past, but not cabbage. So I need some... I need some... Well, well, well. <laughs> I take one sip from my drink and I look back and see you're uh, thinking of stealing. No, I... Uh, well, it looks like there's no one around to see. So you thought you were going to be a noble elf, did you? Well, I think uh, you'll find that you're going to steal everything in this little inn and then you're going to walk off being... Shush, Rosie! <laughs> I won't do any of those things. I just want to buy some salt. You got any salt? Maybe you could talk some sense into my pig... I don't care about your pig-headed brother. Well, I don't know what. Take a look. You got any salt? What? No, I don't want a hawk, a loaf. You got any salt? For God's sake! Right. I think I need I to get. get back to cleaning the store. Come I need on. to get to, to White Run. How far away is White Run? Uh, not far. <laughs> it's very easy to get to. Outside of survival mode, but I'm already hungry. I don't need to be eating food right now. Right? I'll, I'll eat an apple. Is that done it? No, he's still hungry. Does the bar have to be full to be considered as like you know? <coughs> I mean, you're peckish, so yeah. you know your peckish is fine. I've eaten a salmon and an apple for breakfast. Normally, I just have some toast. That's I'm, what normal people have. Like, I'm peckish all day. Your your elf can live. Like, you know, everyone's peckish. Only, like, you know, dinner time mainly is when you're like, oh, I'm really full. John Gingras says salt is listed in ingredients. I'm going to go back and see if I can get any salt. Ooh. 
So people are saying check the tanning rack. What's on the ch tanning rack? That's just for tanning leather. It doesn't make anything. Oh, what if there's a camping here? So you just make leather strips out of leather at the ca tanning rack. There's nothing else. You don't do anything else on it. Um. Up he goes. Steve E says, Peckish, cue the overcooked chefs. Remind me, I played Overcooked a couple of months ago with my friend and we actually did very well on it. It's the best I've probably, the furthest I've gotten Overcooked. Got any salt? <laughs> Domino Whatever says, there's is everything you need in it. Some make Sorry, Domino said, there's plenty of salt here, but not for eating. <laughs> oh, I like that one. Oh, he's got more food now. Look. He's got a cabbage for six gold. Well, there's no ingredients here. Ingredients, I've got ingredients. He doesn't sell any ingredients. Weapons. Throw the salt Damn in the eyes. As if things Don't think it's going to be a weapon. <sighs> I'm afraid. I wish I could help you. All I'm, like, If I'm quiet, it's because I'm trying to read the comments of people who are trying to help. And I'm like, okay, processing information. Uh, I'm a potato says, are you going to do Nathan the Christmas elf this year? No, sadly the elf I don't think, well, I mean, I don't know, but it's not going to be. We'll be doing something for Christmas. Well, we're doing something for Christmas. We will reveal it in good time. It's raining now. Is that going to affect your temperature? Is that going to make you cold? Oh, I hope not. It looks like it, doesn't it? How survivory is survivor's mode? We're about to find out. This is very soothing rain though. Oh, this makes me want to get up in a blanket. I mean, the little frosty symbol on the top suggests that I am cold, doesn't it? It is looking... Did, it, will it be on your symbol, the way it said, like, peckish? Will it say you're now cold? I hope, I hope so. Let's Anyway, let's pick some, some mushrooms. <gasps> no, I can't really be hauling deer meat around. Oh, your poor elf! He's fine. He's fine. Uru Brody 9 says, Rosie, what will be the next Platinum? And I've had a lot of people ask me about my Platinum progress recently, but sadly I've been playing games which just... I played Silent Hill, which is on the PlayStation 1 over Halloween, so there's no trophies in that. Uh, I've been playing Alien Isolation with my friend on their account. Then I played Lost Judgment, and that's not... I played that for the story. Um... So I haven't got round to platinum in that yet, and currently doing Mass Effect 2, which is new. So I'm not, so I'm hoping to platinum that. So probably Mass Effect 2, but I don't go into a game thinking, am I going to platinum it? You know, I play it, and then I think, okay, how's the platinum progress going? Like Lost Judgment, I'm going to come back to, and do all the stuff here and there. Oh, the rabbit! Oh. It was killed not by me. It was killed by the wolf. That's true. Nature! Wow, this rain is something else, isn't it? Look at that. Can wall. you put the shield over your head just to protect you from <laughs> the rain? <laughs> Should be able to, shouldn't you? Uh. Ethan Code says, How many innocents has Rob murdered? None. You haven't murdered anyone yet. I am being noble and honourable, not committing any crimes. This is survival mode. There's White, one, Ro White Run, Rosie. Look at it. I love the first glimpse Ooh. of it, and even in the rain, it's it's like special. When you come through here and it's not raining though, seeing that just on the hill, emerging. Go on, rain, clear up. <laughs> Go on, rain, get out of here. It's like Edoras from Lord of the Rings. Yes, just like that. Yes. Is Edoras a place? Edoras, yes. I, you, when you watch the films this Christmas, Rosie, yeah. you will see. <laughs> you will learn. You will see. Oh, yes, you will see. 
Uh, Dean Shep says, have we shouted anybody off a mountain yet? And I don't think, I'm uh, guessing you... I've not even got the shout yet. It's the beginning of the game. I was going to say, yeah, for those of you just joining, first of all, huge hello. We're playing uh, Skyrim, the anniversary edition. And uh, we're playing, Rob is playing survival mode on a completely new save. So he doesn't have his famous elf with the gl glass gear and everything. This is just a whole new adventure. I've not really done anything that's going to make me any money, Rosie. Oh, no. You are cold! Oh, no, you're going to die! You're going to die, Rob! Got to eat some hot soup. It's all right. I'm going to get inside in White Run. I'm going to get inside. I do like the music in this game. Everything about this game is wonderful. John Gingras says, 10 years on, this game is still pretty awesome. Oh, I recognize this place. This is where we did the Christmas maze challenge. Where we had to kill... Oh, no, it was um, Krishy Bashy, wasn't it? Where you gave us the challenge of killing... Yeah, you came here. Yeah, I came here. Strange jester. Everyone else was a wolf but me. Uh, Jack Scudder says, Hello all, just want to say thank you all for the great content from you and the team. Oh, thank you very much. That means a lot to us. Mm -hmm. Thrilled you enjoying it and thank you for supporting thank the you show. You got any salt? You got any salt? Salt, salt. Yes! yes! Salt pile! I can afford to buy one salt pile. What would you like to buy from me? Would you like what? to buy some bear claws? I thought you were going to ask me, like, Rosie, what do you want to buy? And I would pick the most expensive thing. <laughs> Would you like to buy some frostbite venom? He looking, he's looking very enthusiastic to buy things. Uh, salt pile. Oh, give them a flower. That'd be nice. They can pin it on their outfit. Right, so I bought some salt. I need somewhere else to cook, though. Can I cook here? Fernando says, watching a Lord of the Rings stream with Rosie would be awesome. It would just be me, like... Oh, look. See a warm-up going by the fire. Watch the symbol. Oh. Hey! There we go. Lovely May I and sit warm. by your fire? Can I steal your things? This is why I need the camping equipment. Flipping act, the rain's just not stopping. Uh, James says, can you build any fences on survival mode? Not that it helped your dino survive. But what are you talking about? Yeah, probably in Jurassic World. Why are you commenting that on this stream? This is Skyrim. <laughs> I mean, I didn't know. Can you build fences in Skyrim? Can you build anything in Skyrim or do you buy houses? You buy houses. Okay. You can modify them and like add cool. things to them. Is closed with the dragons about official business only. Fine, but we'll be keeping an eye on you. Speech increased to 16. Leveled up as well. Oh, I need did the to... music just go raw? Yes, because I leveled up. <laughs> First, I'm desperate to cook. I gotta cook. We have to cook. Jesse! I haven't seen that in ages, Breaking Bad. Jesse! That's the merchant that, um. Greg Chun really likes. Oh, the okay. See, that was all just Skyrim talk. Yeah, you two were happy. You were having the best time with it. And I was there just like, duh, 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 hello. <laughs> Come on in. We got warm food, warm drinks, and warm beds. Can that I is good. Can I cook? The air is warm here. I just need to cook, please. Have you got a cooking pot? Yes. No. Ooh. Yes. All right, let's make some cabbage Sadia, soup. Wake up, dear. Soup is the best when you're like, you know, when you're cold to the bone, like, like you're Absolutely. not just cold, but you, yeah, like, yeah. even if you put on a blanket, like a blanket, you're still cold to the bone. Soup is just. Mm. You want a drink? 
Uh, Barry Swords mm -hmm. asks, hold on, has I Rosie guess, never yeah. played Skyrim? Oh, no, I haven't. Sadly, it was one that I missed out on back in um, the PS3 days. Absolutely. My friends played it, and I was playing loads of other stuff on the PS3. I can't remember what I was playing at the no time. Questions. When did this game came, come out? It was... What was Skyrim, 2011. 2011. What else was in 2011? Uncharted 3. Yeah. Uh... Batman. Arkham City. Yep, I played both those. I was probably playing lots of things, but sadly just missed out on this one. But I definitely want to play this. Just right now I'm doing Mass Effect. You didn't see anything, I wasn't stealing. Oh my god, Jellyfield Panda says, you played Jungle Book Groove Party in 2011, and yes, I did. <laughs> and Sly Raccoon says, Sly Raven 70, yes, I did. I was just playing a bunch of classics. Can I have a room? If it's work you're looking for, Holder's the one to talk to. You got a room. Can I stay at the inn? If you need more, f depends. Are you thirst? No, I need I need a room. If there's nothing else, <laughs> I have work to do. I'm very, I'm fine, thank you, Miss. Can I just sleep? Caravans. I'm going to buy the bannered mare from Holda. How tired is your character? Are they feeling quite tired or I don't think so. But I want I need to sleep so I can level up. Farewell. Ah, oh, he says Rosie was playing it's Parappa the Rapper twenty four seven back in twenty eleven. You know it. Playing it constantly all the time. Honest gold for honest Probably Katamari Forever and all. I played that game loads. Probably my most played PS3 game. Right oh, that's nice of her. Yeah, I sold my firewood as well. Um, because I don't really need it right now. So that stuff said you could just take it, even though it's in an inn. So you're not stealing it. How come you, that one doesn't get considered as stealing? I don't know. I don't know the you rules, know Rosie. Else <laughs> I don't know the the law. <laughs> Slice goat cheese. That's not stealing. Not stealing. Sleep. Ah, sleep. Let's sleep till tomorrow morning. Oh, big sleep. Twenty-four hour. Ooh. I think so. Although I might wake up hungry, I probably will. You're gonna wake up but starving. I want it to be the next day. You're going to be and really thirsty and yeah. really warm. <laughs> James Merrow says, you're not stealing if no one sees you. That's perfect stealing. Ooh. Health or stam stamina, probably, at the moment. Health. Oh, I've seen this menu before. Very pretty, though. So these are all your levels, right? Yeah. Oh, the sneaky, sneaky stuff is all level 20 plus. It begins. The it, stealth journey begins. It begins. Okay, I've leveled up. I awaken feeling well rested and I'm peckish. What a surprise. <laughs> I mean, after like, you know, 20 hours sleep, I don't blame your elf. I'd be starving. I'd be like, you know, just engulf water and then just eat everything in my kitchen. I've taken some bread and some tomatoes. All this, is, none of this is stealing. Oh, sorry, big gulp. Oh, that was weird. <laughs> oh, I went down the wrong way, so you heard me just go, that's why. Look at all this, Rosie. None of it's stealing. What, even the sword? The beef, the cheese. This is a very nice... You can just take a sword. This is a very lovely inn. This is my favourite inn. A honey nut <gasps> treat. That looks good. Oh, that all looks good. <gasps> a sweet roll. Oh, that all looks so good. Have you ever looked into the um, Elder Scrolls recipe cookbook? 
No, I've always wanted to. I know, I've always wanted to try. Like, not that I've ever, but I've always loved the idea of, like, you know, video game recipe books. I believe they've got one for Tomb Raider, which I really want to have a look at. This must be, this must be the game glitching a little bit, because it's not, it's not telling me this is stealing. It's not telling me any of this is bad. Mucky Mo, yeah, Mucky Mo said, um, the game must be feeling sorry for you. Oh. Snap! Oh, oh. Oh, this is exciting. Oh. <laughs> and it goes. Oh. Oh. Hey, that was exciting. That was a bit of intenseness. Yeah, just go steal their money. No, it wasn't. It didn't say stealing. It wasn't stealing. But you just broke into their lot. Like, even if the game doesn't it say... It would say <laughs> if it was stealing, Rosie. That wasn't <laughs> stealing. The game didn't say it was. What can I cook? Can I not even cook some tomato soup? Uh, Gillen Borum says, is lock picking harder in survival mode? I don't know. Oh. No, I don't think so. I need salt and garlic. Why do you need... You don't need garlic. Just just do it with the tomatoes. Just chuck in anything salt. you've got. I need salt, salt, salt. Ah, oh, here we go. Uh, we got loads of food. Eat everything. Oliver Bar says, crack bread. open the Heinz. And some apples. Nom, 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 nom. I have a sweet roll. I have a honey nut treat. It's just still not. It's still not. Nicola Hughes says garlic makes everything better, and I love garlic. I am a huge garlic fiend. I do I'm, like garlic. I can eat, like, I'll eat a whole garlic bread, go to my friend's house, stink of garlic, and I'm just like, I'm really sorry, but I'm, I'm in garlic heaven right now. <laughs> I stink, but embrace it. How much food will he eat before he's not peckish anymore? He's still hungry. <laughs> he's honestly just eaten about five loaves of bread, five apples. <laughs> and he's, uh, and I like a bit your elf. Hungry. Your elf's very relatable. <laughs> I'll take the salmon steak. I'm going to take the apple pie. I'll take all of it. I love how you like missed out on the, the fruit and veg that was on the table. You're like, steak and apple pie. Yes. <laughs> Come on, man. <laughs> this is this whole stream's just gonna be survival goat's mode. Cheese. An entire wheel <laughs> of goat's cheese. He's oh there we go. You are now satisfied. Is he though? Good. Lord. I bet I'd so laugh if you walk outside and his tummy goes. Oh. Right, it better not be raining anymore. It's not. It's beautiful and sunny. Yay. Let's go make some money. Isn't this where the the man is who everyone hates as well? The one who says like. Nazim. That's the yeah. That's the one. Isn't he from here? He is. Let's see if he's around. They say Helgen got hit by a dragon. Shh. One of those here he is. From here. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Nazim. Stealing some leaks, are we? Stroking them. <laughs> I like these leaves. What are you doing, Nazim? <laughs> He's stroking them. <laughs> yes. Do not have leaks up in the cloud district, Nazim. Do you get to the cloud district very often? Oh, what am I saying? Of course you don't. <laughs> That's the line. That's the famous line. Oh my god, is it that is this it? Is it gonna be murder time? Nazim is he's, he's a brave fellow, you know, like this elf just full on brings a sword looming over him. And he's just like, ha ha ha. You don't sure scare me. There's a, a wood block around here where I can chop some more firewood. Why is my memory failing me today? Making firewood is a great mate is a great way to make early money in the game. 
the amount of people saying like, just kill Nazim. <laughs> but you held back. You resisted temptation. I did. I'm proud of you, Rob. I think you've turned a new leaf in your Nazim friendship. You'll become the best of friends now. Yes. I need an iron ingot, and I need some firewood for a fishing rod. Oh, Joshua Smith says, take all the plats and cups from the inn and sell to Bellathor. I mean, if it's not classed as stealing, you could just do that. Oosh! Well done. Can I use it, please? Nope, my wood. He's got some wood stuck to his hands there. <laughs> no, that's just his axe. Helps him have more grip. <laughs> Can I please use the wood chopping block? Sigurd? Nah. He's full on staring you in the face as he does it, though. Like, Can you... I please? <sighs> okay, what should we... I need to go make some money. We need to progress the story as well. Um... Yonchan84 says, Hello, what's this I hear about Rob not killing in Skyrim? It's a new, it's a new journey today. Right, I'm going back to Riverwood to talk because I missed out. I, for some reason, didn't talk to Gerda, which is a critical story mission. So I'm going to talk to Gerda. Then I'm on the way, Maybe hopefully, hopefully get some money off something on the way. Like a bandit or something. For those of you joining the stream as well, hello, first of all, huge welcome. Hope you're having a lovely day. Uh, Rob is currently on survival mode in Skyrim, where he is surviving. Um, and that's the best way to summarize the stream, I think. He's been very hungry. <laughs> surviving so far. <laughs> He's surviving. surviving so far. Winnerpool says, this stream brings back so many winter cozy memories. I have to play it again after a long time. Yeah, definitely do it. Do it. If I was to play this, I was definitely like, you know, thinking of playing this game this winter. This is very nice though. I love, I love the color. Look at that. Oh. It's wonderful. It's just wonderful. Have you ever got lost in Skyrim? That's, like that's... like when you first played it 10 years ago, for example? Yeah, well, that's all you do. That's the whole point of the game. Get lost in it. Get lost and hope you're, you come out okay. Lucy Soby says, I hope you're both having a lovely day as well, by the way. Oh, thank you very much. Thank you, Lucy Soby. We've had a day full of laughs, full <laughs> of productivity. <laughs> there have been some laughs. There have been some laughs. Some lols. Anyway, this is the view we'd have gotten if the weather was good, Rosie. Oh, yeah, I could see, like, yeah. I mean, I thought, at first I thought it was very intimidating, like, with the fog and then just the silhouette of this big building on a hill, but... But now I can see the, the niceness. What's that sun icon that was to the right of the... That means I'm feeling warm. Oh. So that's like the first glimpse you get. All warm and cozy that's inside. Run, yeah. DH33.0 says, I've never played this, but I've got all the music. And I'll tell you, I've done that as well with some games where I've never played it, but I've listened to the music. So I do not blame you there. Oh, this is nice. This is making me think of my holiday I went on a couple of months ago. When it was just nature and waterfalls. Perfect. Perfect holiday. It was so good. Right, Riverwood then. I need to speak to Gerda. Hmm, a deer. Oh dear. Doe, a deer, a female deer. Off it goes. Don't go into the lake, dear. Look That's at right. The, look at the water. I mean, why would you just not to... Why would <laughs> you did a little dance on the rock. <laughs> why would you not want to spend just all of your time in this game? Why play anything else? There is no world like it. Do you think you're going to drop everything you're doing and replay it? Yeah. Yeah. Of course I am. 
It's out again, and I've got all the trophies to earn once more. Well, I will have to do with the trophy run separate to... <gasps> crabs! Yeah, mud oh. crabs. Oh. Or crab. I thought it was more than one. It was a rock. Uh, Serzus asks, what's the red part to the left of the stamina bar? Is that your just your hunger? Oof. The mud crab knows he's coming. Off he goes. Where is he? Where's he gone? The mysterious mud crab. Oh, I love this one. No, don't kill him. He's been great. No. <laughs> Missed. That'll, no, that'll he's my favourite Skyrim Give character. Give me your crab meat. Nom 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 nom. Leroy Judah says Skyrim peckish edition. <laughs> peckish mode, constantly peckish. So what I'm doing now is I'm eating raw ingredients. And when you do that, you discover their effects. And oh. after you've discovered their effects, you can make potions with them in alchemy. Oh, so you have to poison yourself then to make a cure for it. Sometimes, yes. But at the moment, I'm just re restoring stamina. Like with, so I know that these mushrooms, for example, restore magicka now. But now, Nightshade is almost certainly going to poison me. Do it. Oh, yeah. whoa. But but ah! I do know that that creates a poison now. So now when I find that in the field, you can go to an alchemy station and you can start creating potions. And that's also a very good way to make money. Find cheap ingredients out in the field, make mm -hmm. potions with them, sell the potions, harvest. You just take all that person's fish. No. Someone's just done a lot of fishing. They've hung it out They've to dry. They've left it there for they, me. They hung it out to dry and then you just took it. That's like, you know, someone doing their laundry and then you're like, oh, I like that shirt. I'm going to take <laughs> it. <laughs> and if it doesn't say when I go to grab the shirt, steal, then it's fine. <laughs> right. Good. I don't owe you money, do I? No, you don't. New to Riverwood? If you're looking for work, go see Hod at the mill. Here's the key to the house. Stay as long as you like. If there is anything else you need, just let me know. Yay! <gasps> yes, yes! I'll take the carrots, I'll take the firewood, I'll take the lockpick, I'll take the... Po I'll take the apple. Oh, seeing those baked potatoes has really Your put me in the mood for jacket potato. There is something you could do for me. Oh! For all of us here. Mm. The Jarl needs to know if there's a dragon on the loose. <gasps> Riverwood is defenseless. We need to get word to Jarl Balgruf in Whiterun to send whatever troops he can. If you'll do that for me, I'll be in your debt. Of course I will. Of course I will. Actually, will you marry me? I love you now. <laughs> <laughs> Matt Smith says, it didn't say steal, Rosie. It said harvest. It did say, well, I'm going to harvest this shirt. There's <laughs> 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 some someone else's uh, laundry. I'm going to harvest this shirt <laughs> I've seen on the washing line. Let's get some more firewood and then I can sell it. Another good way to make a little bit of money. Mucky Mo, hello stranger, have my house keys. <laughs> Actually, you can help me while I think of it. Well, I'm not a stranger because I helped her brother. Well, that's nice. Did you also harvest his fish? No. <laughs> I helped him escape from a dragon. Firewood. Don't want to chop too much of it. Otherwise, I'll be over encumbered. No one wants that. I'm annoyed about this camping set, though. I really wanted the camping set. Maybe I didn't download it, and that's the problem. Well, I'm pretty sure I did. Sven and Hilda's house. So is she the one is, is are they the, I didn't see her name, but are they, where's the house you now own? <laughs> one of the houses is now in It's yours. the inn, I think. Oh, okay. So it's just a room rather than a whole house. Well, you could steal from here before. So let's see if you could steal. Yeah, so you can steal here, right. General store. Do you want to buy the silver ring? My sister Camilla or I will... Uh, yeah, we... Uh, 
an ornament. Starstruck Solid MJ gold. says, Hello, I'm admittedly late. What did I miss? You You've missed Rob harvesting some, some fish, taking it's every bit of food from an inn, but not back. stealing it, eating everything he comes across and still is being peckish, um, and getting, we got a bit cold in the rain, but it's fine, we warmed up. They did, yeah. And, um... For 52 gold, are you going to have that ring? Go on. And that's been it, really. I've got 200 gold now, Rosie. <laughs> 200 rich. gold. I am rich. 200 gold. <laughs> 200 <laughs> gold. Bro, did you say? 200 gold. I did. <laughs> <laughs> um, food. Food is what I need. Cabbage. Salt. Please. Please, Salt. Now, if you're going to get those Give me salt. Falls Barrow, northeast of town. I can't yeah. cook anything without now salt. Have to go, <laughs> oh really? Well, I think your new helper here needs a guide. Shut up. Mr. Bonus says it's been an hour. Even I could set up a camp in an hour. And do you mean in real life? I think that's what they mean. Yeah. Yeah, everyone's loving the 200 gold. <laughs> 200 gold. <laughs> 200 gold. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love bringing microphones closer. You said I could stay here, didn't you? Is that, can, I, can I sleep in the bed? You said I could stay here however long I like. No, no. Yeah, Apparently I can't sleep in else. there now. They were like, Fine. we know you went to another town well, to me, sleep in their this, bed. Rosie. Here's alchemy. Alchemy Ooh. there. So... I've not got any ingredients. So you can't do alchemy on any... You can't be an alchemist until you've had the effects on yourself. Yeah. Oh. So I've just created one little potion there, look. But whilst you go out into the into the world, you can find a bunch of ingredients. And, uh, and steal. stealing in here. Okay, so I've got enough food. I've got enough money. I'm going to go back to... No, the dog! dog. Save the, the dog. dog! Save the dog! No, dog! No. Oh, he's fine. He's sort of asleep. He's just sleeping. We're just hanging on the edge of it. He's all right. He's all right. He's all right. I could do with an iron ingot then, and then I could go fishing here. <laughs> Pedantic Gaming says, if you buy oh, a bed... A fishing rod! Oh. I don't even have to make it. Oh, must have it equipped. We're going fishing! It's happening! Uh, <clears throat> so, I will favourite it. Equip. Fish. Josh says, he's just hanging around. Pedantic Gaming says, standing on the edge. And Alex says, silly doggo. <laughs> <laughs> right, here we go, fishing. Oh. Well, you didn't even have to pull it in. You just threw your cast you out. and then X. Visit the Rifton Fishery. That's miles away. Do we have a competition so you can get the biggest fish? I don't know if size is going to matter like that. Harvest the fish, says Bucky Mo. Harvest the fish. Yeah, you put your fish you've caught out to dry and then be sad if someone takes it. What's that? Oh, a spade fish. It's a pet fish. A pet fish. Like, you know, it's a small enough to be like a little pet. Can't believe harvest the fish. Oh. 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 Domino said last half an hour is fishing. Oh, Hope what's prepared. this? River Betty. Let's cook them. Let's cook all my fish that I've caught. Uh, da -da 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 -da. I wish you could get like a bowl and then put that pretty fish and be like, this is my fish pet now. Gonna cook the fish. There was cooking here, wasn't there? I remember. Mr. Bonus asks, uh, how does the fishing work? You just get a fishing rod. I just found one there, but you can also craft one at the blacksmiths with some firewood and an iron ingot. Um, then you can't fish anywhere. You have to go to designated fishing spots like the one I was just at then. Can I not cook my fish? 
Troy Green says, I love fishing in games. Far Cry 5 had, uh, Far, Far Cry 5 had great fishing mechanics. I like fishing in games too. It's very nice and relaxing. <gasps> John Gingras says, you can get an aquarium. Why are you cooking the pretty fish? And uh, why are you cooking any fish? Put them in the aquarium. I'm desperate for some salt. That's what I need. You're a strapping young man. Ooh. Don't be a stranger. Steady on. Yeah, way up. Way up. We got any salt up here I can nick. Sorry, harvest. So eat your harvest, yeah. <laughs> Blooming harvest. Right. Back to Whiterun. I'm looking, getting hungry again, aren't I? He's just never... The insatiable appetite of this guy. I feel quite hungry. My name's Henry. Literally, I had a friend who played Kingdom Come Deliverance all the time, and all I heard was, I feel quite hungry. <laughs> Hawk hello, I'll eat one of those. You are well fed. Thank you. Look, full stamina now. Oh, it's five o'clock already. We haven't done anything. I could honestly just sit here all day playing this. You should. You should do like an all day stream. I mean, I but will, like I will 24 hours Skyrim stream. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, how's it going? All right, Embry. Good to see you, mate. Hello. I am now the bridge. <laughs> just ignore him. Ignore him. Oh, my God. I love that. Anything to harvest? No, I've already taken that. Oh, some thistles. Shall I go hunting? Because we're being hunted. Ooh. Do you have enough? Are you able to carry the deer meat? Oof. Oh, the elk, sorry. Everyone's now saying, out. gotta love Skyrim. I think, so for someone who's never played an Elder Scrolls game, would you say Skyrim or Oblivion? Oh, Skyrim, for sure. Skyrim. Well, A, you can easily get it on PS5 and PS4. Oh, God, it's being attacked <gasps> by a wolf. Oh, oh Rosie! Oh my that's God. how you do it! I thought he was going to hit the wolf in like a, in a, in a quick turn event. like. Ooh. Oh, see? That's what you get decade, a whole decade of doing nothing but sneaking around shooting arrows into things. And then you become the master. The master of the bow. Elk. Or sneak increased to 22. Uh, venison. Oh, imagine cooking that. Oh, Captain Hook says, oh dear. That's right. <laughs> Wait, small antlers. Deer I hide. I like it. It's a Quite heavy, but also quite valuable, and I can make lots of leather with it, which I can then sell. The wolf! I'll take the wolf pelt as well. Right, there's White Run. Look at it. Beautiful. That is really nice. I love a good waterfall. Waterfalls are great. Apart from in the moments where, like, you know, they're really deep and got loads of rocks at the bottom, then they're dangerous. Just don't yeah. ride them. They're quite benign in uh, Skyrim. You can easily jump down waterfalls. Watch this. Whee! Nothing bad will happen. Nothing bad will happen. To Not me. in survival mode. Whee! Uh, it'll be fine. It'll be fine. Oh! oh God! It'll be fine. Oh my Why? God! Ooh. Oh, it's, it'll be fine. Just a spine. Oh. Just my spine. Nothing to worry about. It'll be fine. And, oh, ow, we're at the bridge. All the villagers are like, did you see the elf just falling down the waterfall? Going, ow, ow, ow. And look, we're here. It's raining again in Whiterun. God, Whiterun love, is like I Scotland. I love how you just went like down loads of waterfalls. You're dripping wet. And then as soon as it's raining, the game's like, oh, now you're cold. <laughs> 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 yeah, you might be a bit cold now, mate. It's in the rain. Yeah, you're in the rain. A bit chilly now. Ah, I mean the rain is good. I think this is like modded rain, improved weather rain. 
Matusa says, VOD Squad here, can't wait to watch it from the beginning later. Well, welcome to being not a VOD Squad member, Matusa. Hope you're having a lovely day, and I'm hoping that when you're watching the beginning of the stream, you're also having a lovely day. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Hello. There's a nip in the air. Cold won't be good for my crops. Honest pay for honest work. Oh, don't take all my cabbages. Oh, come on! No! Oh my no. god! No! Oh, I was going to make cabbage soup with those. That's karma for harvesting the fish. <laughs> God you know, see? Sake. Oh, he didn't steal it. You gave it to him. All that hard-earned cabbage you picked up from a barrel. You're supposed to be on my side, Rosie. <laughs> I'm defender of the fish. <laughs> or the stranger who hung up their fish to dry. Can I sleep here? Oh, yes, yes, you can. can. That just... looks warm. Ah, <sighs> sleep in it. <laughs> Jellyful Panda Still says raining. he just harvested the cabbages. <laughs> yes, he did. You are peckish and you are warm. Of course, he's always peckish. I'd say I love how we've got six bits of gold since we were talking about how we had 200 gold. <laughs> <laughs> now we have 206 gold. Oh, look at the weather. Like it, the weather looks so much better with the the mods enabled. Okay, it's so dark and wet. This was such a blanket game. Have we done a list on like you know blanket games? Games you just want to wrap up in a blanket and play. Like like we pillow fort, pillow fort. Yeah. And it, Skyrim for me is just the ultimate blanket game. Can you see why, Rosie? It's, yeah. It's I could definitely see. I know that when I play this, I am going to be, you know, just completely engulfed in it. I'm just going to be run Because I love that. Like, you know, even playing Elden Ring recently, I just love just running around and discovering things. To, side quests, talking to people, helping people, doing the things. Like, And then also this kind of universe. So I fully know well that when I play this, I'm going to be loving it. Ah. Let's get to the all. Deliver him the message. You are peckish. Said the game. Uh, Dean Shep says Final Fantasy 7 is my pillow game. Oh, that's a very, yeah. Pillow game. Yeah. You heard of pillow talk. Yeah, but so we Final got Fantasy VII is my pillow game. <laughs> Skyrim is the blanket. <laughs> Metal Gear Solid is the sheets. The sheets game. You know, the reliable sheets. Chilly, am I? Well, let's get in here then. Watch this, Rosie. I love this place. Dragon's Reach. Oh. Look at the amazing structure of it. The wood beams. Oh. That does look nice. I only counsel caution. We cannot afford to act rashly in times like these. Excuse me, what can I use your fire? Oh! The meaning Nothing. of this interruption. Your Balgoth is not receiving this is visitors. Time. He will receive me. I just think we need more well, information. Well, explains why the guards let you in. I just... Come on then. The there weren't any guards, guards at the door, were there? Uh, the guard in front of the city. So oh. You, you saw this dragon with your own eyes? <laughs> yes, I had a great view while the Imperials were trying to cut off my head. I should have guessed Ulfric would be mixed up in this. What do you say now, Proventus? Shall we continue to trust in the strength of our walls against the dragon? My lord, we should send troops to Riverwood at once. It's in the most immediate danger. If the Yarl dragon Ulfric is lurking in the mountains. That is a provocation. He'll assume we're preparing to join Ulfric's side and attack him. We should Enough. not. I'll not stand idly by while the dragon burns my hold and slaughters my people. Yeah, shut up, Preventus. People keep on saying Preventus looks like me. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think so. Excuse me. <laughs> oh my god, we should put you in a dressing That's gown. Put a belt around well you. Done. 
You sought me out on your own initiative. You've done White Run a service, and I won't forget it. Here, take this as a small token of my esteem. There is another thing you could do for me. Ooh. Suitable for someone of your particular... Come, let's go find Faringar, my court wizard. He's been looking into a matter related to these dragons and rumors. So when he said of your skill set, is that like, you know, is that for everyone's character? Is everyone's yeah, character got... just, you know, He's just adventurer, nice. basically. Hello. Faringar. Come to Dragon's Reach to discuss the ongoing hostility. <laughs> hmm? What? Project? You think you could help me? I really don't think so. You know, Ooh. if you've got the aptitude, you should join. It seems this damnable conflict has claimed everyone's passions of late. Me? I prefer my books Go ahead and, and my stuff. With all the Goodbye. And he's like, this is why I prefer my books and my spells. Everyone just walks away from me. Yeah, I'm talking to you. So the old thinks you can be of use to me. Oh, yes, he must be. Yes. Well, when I say fetch, I really mean delve into it. Straight to the point, eh? I love how you can tell you've played this so many times. Yeah, yeah, I know where I'm going. Leave those details. You're better, am I right? All right, then. There's a tranquility in magic, don't you think? Ah, uh, yes, I... Well, when I say fetch, I really mean delve into... You are eager to begin your... Uh, adventure. Douglas White so, says, Rob play? I, uh, in a question mark. Yes, Rob is playing today because... Rob won't let anyone else play Skyrim on the channel. No! <laughs> and bring it to me. Simplicity itself. Right. The priority <laughs> Anything we can <gasps> use to fight oh, it's burned me. I thought it was salt. Need it quickly before it's too late. Right, I've got to go to a place, a dungeon, Rosie, and fight Woo! some stuff. Fight some stuff. Do the things. Oh God, never-ending rain. Winterpool says I was always stealing potions from that guy. What you mean, the poor wizard? Oh. It looks very daunting in the in the rain and like it does, doesn't it? Could do with a torch as well. Could do with the campsite is what I could do with. How's your hunger, by the way? It looks. Well, I can see at the bottom right my stamina bar. You can see the red creeping in from the left. Mm. So I'm gonna stay a night at the inn. You are warming up. You are warm. Stay a night at the inn, um, and then I'm gonna do my adventure. Come on in, just stoke the fire. Take Kay Parrish says, I can't play Skyrim with other people. It's like sharing a magic portal. Which is very fair. Got any salt? If it's work, a fine thing. day to you. Drink for the thirsty, food for the hungry. Yes. You've paused on a beautiful face. Oh! Sure thing, it's yours for a day. Thank you. I'll show you to your room. I know That's where it is. <laughs> nope, I know where it is. You can Let go me away. Cook up some nice cabbage soup, please. I have not got any cabbages left. Have I? Ah! You can go do um brook bass. Like my brook bass. Brook, ba bro brook bass. I'll cook the other brook bass that I have. I'm sure I caught some more fish than that. I can't believe. You did. You and you decided to put them all in the aquarium. <laughs> Well, we all know there's now an aquarium. Go away, Sadia. No more questions. Where's? There she is. Can I have some cabbages, please? I enjoy this work well. In... Let's save that appetite, hmm? Cabbages. Oh. Got a cabbage. <laughs> cabbage. 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 Got three. Poor lady. Three cabbages. I'll take them all, and I'll take all your bread as well. I'll have the apple. That's quite expensive. Baked potatoes, apple pie. Yes. Uh, Bismarck's 129 I says, I remember platinum this over over two years ago. I've heard a lot of people have platinum this, which is great. Like, shows a lot of people love it. Why can't I make... Oh, my have God, I've just used now? all my salt! Right, <laughs> I am so... We should rename the stream The Quest for Salt. <laughs> it is. That is exactly what it is, isn't it? Either Elder Salt Skyrim or Elder Scrolls... Scrolls Salt Rim. Sky Salt. No. Salt, just salt. Uh, 
Yeah, I thought I knew where the room was. Where is it? It's a lady you're looking for. Get out of the way. Lord from Mud says. Cabbages. Cabbages. I don't want to hear. I don't want to hear about your cabbages. Would you like my cabbages? Let's go to sleep. Enough. Yes, go to sleep. I'm having great fun. Oh, I'm so sorry, everyone in chat's probably ruining your ears. Cabbage. One more. What's wrong with Skyrim these days? Looks like I'm hungry. It's still raining. Hunger. Peckish. I can't believe how hungry I am just all the time. <laughs> Ash says, oh, how is Skyrim going? I wonder how they're getting on with survival before <laughs> salted cabbages. <laughs> cabbage soup, Ash. Salted cabbage soup. See, Ash, you've played Skyrim. I'm being introduced to Skyrim with just cabbages. To me, all this game is, is... Cabbage. Everything is cabbage. It's just not stop raining the entire time. Right, let's get up to the first quest. Oh, God. Yes, the rain's stopping. Ah. The rain's stopping. I like rain. I'm someone who likes rain. I like it. I like looking at it. I like the sound of it. I like this bit when it's just stopped and the sun is coming out ah. and the rain sort of steams off the ground. I love the music as well. Blue Planet says, Rosie, can we get a star style cabbage? And I don't think I can do my Nem Nem stars whilst eating the microphone. I think that would p pierce your ears. Maybe a quiet one. Okay, let me try. No, Rosie, don't. Stop. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> and then when it's away, I can go, stars. Someone's just said um, Skyrim Scotland edition, and it is, it is a lot like Scotland. I've never been to Scotland. Oh, I Scotland. really want to go. I've heard Honestly, it's beautiful. My favourite country on the planet. I love it. It's good for the soul. Yeah. Being there. Right. God, we've only got we've only got twelve minutes of the stream. I know. Now. It's barely going to be enough to, time to kill anything. So, Shall we summarise? How's our how's your survival adventure been? Let's look back on our journey. Well, I'm still alive. I've not died once. Yep. I've survived. Um, I've got some money now. How much money have I got? One hundred nine <laughs> gold. I've got one hundred nine <laughs> gold. <laughs> yes. Um, and. About to go and um, hopefully kill my first. You haven't stolen everything. You've harvested. I've not stolen anything. You've harvested and you've taken. I've not committed any crime. Nope. No one's died. No crimes have been committed. You've caught some fish. You didn't make a campsite, sadly, but I know that's a bit of a shame. You didn't need it anyway. I must have. I must have just not downloaded the. Um, excuse me. Oh my god. The creation pack, and I thought I had. Because um, I'm sure you're supposed to be able to just craft it. Oh, and then Blythe says, but we're still looking. Oh, and we were looking for salt. There's been lots of salt We've done a lot of looking hunting. for salt, yeah, yeah. People are loving it when we eat the microphones. <laughs> not eating the microphones. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. I'll stop now. Or maybe. Maybe I'll do one more before. Let's see how I'm feeling. I'm in a rapscallion mood. I'm being a rapscallion, basically. Quick Hatch says, no murder or crime? Are you even playing Skyrim? Yes. We're playing the engulfing time of Skyrim. Right. So, it's the other way from the bridge up the mountain into the, into the tomb. This is no mine. It's a tomb. It's a big tomb. Now, if I remember, if I remember, 
There's some nasty stuff up here. Hola, buzzard. That was a Tomb Raider theme for the tomb. Get it. Get it. No. No. Get it. Beautiful. Beautiful. Buzzard, or is it an eagle? Might be an eagle, even. Oh. Oh! I think there's also a frostbite spider up here. <gasps> there it is. It's behind there. What's that, a spider? No, it's a, that's a wolf. Okay. So I thought you said a spider. Yeah. Oh, it got ya! No, it didn't. Oh. I got it. Take these mushrooms. I think. But further up here, I'm pretty sure there's a spider hiding up here. If memory serves me. Oh my god. Uh, Liger says Rosie is a parapascallion, <laughs> which I love. <laughs> parapscallion. Paraps parapascallion. All snow crumbling. I love the sound of it. Yeah, it's going to start getting cold up here. <laughs> Josh says, does Rob still have cabbages? <laughs> no. So I asked the question because I like how you don't have any cabbages anymore. <laughs> Jones, la, 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 la. <laughs> you all have your fun and laughs. <laughs> Jonesy says the lack of salt is just insulting. Insulting. Ah. Ha ha ha. Yeah. Look, there's a baddie. Ooh. In his little tower. This is my tower. Oh no, he's got a mate. Oh, nice. I love that in Ghost of Tsushima using the arrow and then when you get like a distant shot. Alright, we're gonna need to go close the distance here. You're as good as dead. Andrew Johnson says Robera's the cabbageless. <laughs> oh. Have some of that! No. That's right, that's right. Oh, she didn't fall very far. I was hoping that she'd actually like properly fall, she's but she's got cooked beef, she's got gold, she's got a lock pick. But That's... no salt. <sighs> no. <laughs> <laughs> they might have a fire I can warm myself up out there. There's more bandits in there for sure. Oliver Barf says you are harvesting their life. Yes, that's right. That's exactly what I'm doing. Lazy Ninja 45 says now you're just rubbing salt into the wound. <gasps> you just took it. That's not stealing though, that's they're bandits, Rosie. We, we I just am, added. <laughs> I am reclaiming it. We got twenty-five gold. <laughs> twenty-five gold. Oh, I do love I do love clearing out a bandit hideout. Oh, he spotted me. Come on then. Oh, she's wearing the, the, the helmet that I've seen in loads of Skyrim promotion. Right? That's the helmet. Skyrim promotion. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's a famous helmet, watch right? Watch this. Watch this, Rosie. Okay. Whoa! Yeah! <laughs> burn! Oh! You will burn. That should warm me up. Got a fire up here. Yeah, why do you have to worry about being cold if you could just put fire on your hands and then just like, you know, just cautiously use it to keep warm? Amulet of Kinnereth. Let's go. Yeah, see, Oliver Barth says, not chilly anymore. No, you're not. I mean, you technically still are, but you shouldn't be. No. I really should not be. Look at that shot. Sorry. Yeah, that I'm is sorry. Uh, right in the Did nose. Do you remember how far away I was when I shot this guy? Right in the right nostril. You gave him a good piercing, you did. I did indeed. Wait, have I gone the right way? Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's this way. Oh, 
Lucky Mo says, I like my bandits. Well done. <laughs> Crispy. Now there are a bunch of bandits around here. I need to get inside quickly. Lest I get overrun. Oh. <gasps> Bleak Falls Barrow! Yeah. It's cold here. Where is everyone? There's definitely loads of bandits around here. I know it for a fact. They saw what you did to the other bandits and thought, Whoa, okay, don't mess with this guy. We're out of here. We're taking our cabbage and we're leaving. I might just make He won't believe us if we tell him we don't have any salt. <laughs> Where are they? They're usually all over this park. Does someone see me? Someone see me. Wait to count out your coin. All two hundred gold of them. So how come you're using your fire magic now? Just because it, you just feel like it. Yes. Nice. Hiya. I'm out. Garrett Hudson says. Ooh! No. Boosh, nice. Sorry, Garrett, but uh, Garrett said, in real life, would Rob or Rosie survive longer in this cold? Hmm. I don't really understand that question. I don't know. So if we were in this cold situation, how would, would we? How would we decide that? Yeah, how would... <laughs> I don't know. <sighs> right, let's get inside. This is where the real adventure begins. I'm just going to say... Rob will win. <laughs> Cold, I need to get inside. Cold and peckish. Surely it's a bit warmer in here. I hope, anyway. The air is warm in here. So, what, this is the tomb? The Bleak Fool's Barrow. Uh huh. Weapons, uh, food. Back to the stealthy archer. Dong. Get rid of the pot! It's an obstruction! I think they spoiled you! <laughs> oh no! No messing. <clears throat> Back my arrow, thank you very much. Gold lockpick. Oh, he had a steel sword. I think I've already got a steel sword there. Pushima says, This elf no. eats like me when I'm bored. <laughs> I'm bored, I'm just gonna eat. That's what I've already got a steel sword. Oh, look at bed. Oh, you can sleep. Rest. Sleep in the bed of those who you just harvested. <laughs> <laughs> Harvest their beds. Oh, look at that. I'm basically alright at the moment, though. I don't really need to sleep. Sleeping will just make me a bit hungrier. Look, Rosie. <gasps> Remember that video? Yes! What do you think is going to happen? You're going to find salt in the tomb. <laughs> <laughs> Out of everything to happen. No, there's going to be spiders. But Rob, it's 5.30. What are you going to do? I'm, I'm playing still. <laughs> playing. You can go home if you like, Rosie. <laughs> I just want to... There is a spider. Go on, let's see. Yeah, let's, yeah show me the spider. Show me the spider. I haven't seen a spider since, like, you know, the first 10 minutes of this game I played where I got lost and accidentally found myself in a spider cave and died all the time. And was very confused as to what to do. 
This spider, I believe, is quite difficult on survival mode. Just gonna give it a little save. <laughs> Just in case. Ryan Claire says all night stream. We're, yeah, you know we're talking about doing a 24-hour stream. It's today! <laughs> I literally would just, you know, play it the whole time. I love it. I love a bandit. An unsuspecting. Uh-oh. They're strong. Uh-oh. I'm in trouble, Rosie. Time to end this little game. He's ready. He's coming. He doesn't care about those arrows. He's like, you fool, I already have fire. Oh. <laughs> he was a bit stronger. Bandit outlaw, he's got a torch, that might be good. I don't remember this bit being right here. It's not how you were. You don't know the game as well as you thought you I did. I have no memory of this place. <laughs> ah! Whoa, yeah, let's do the puzzle whoa. straight away. So, snake, snake, fish. Oh, you're poisoned, I think. At least I'm guessing. Snake, snake, fish. Snake, snake, fish. Crawly noises. Pickpocket. Increased. I've got two levels to go up now. I should sleep. I love the Level leveling up. up noise. Have we done a video on like the best leveling up noises? <laughs> Write it down. Write it down. Write it down. Best leveling up sound. You can have this one. You can have the one from Symphony of the Night when it goes. Doo -doo 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 -ding. Why am I looking in there? It says empty. Oh, no, more no, no. spider webs. Some rats are going to come up, I think. Some skeevers. Skeevers. Oh! <laughs> Wee! <laughs> I took a lot out of me. Licking rats are things. always a huge pain. Ah, uh, we should end the stream though, Rose, is what we should do. No, uh, well, we haven't Wait, encountered. the spider's right here. Oh, is there a spider right here? Okay. Let's do the spider. If it kills me, it kills me. Quickly, drink your potion. Get pumped. Get the spider. Get the spider. For the audience, Ash has just got into the streaming room for us and she said, Why are you doing this when I've just come into the streaming room? Because she hates spiders. Oh, look at it! Is that the spider crying? No. Ow! Ow! <laughs> this in VR, I'm telling you now, is honestly one of the most horrible things. Oh, I can imagine. I hate spiders. I've like... ever experienced. Oh, it's giving me shivers. I've got goosebumps looking at the spider. Oh. The way they move is honestly is horrible. Oh, it's got a, so a mate trapped. Get it away from me. Get it away. I'm liking this this confused spider. He's like, oh, I'm gonna go over Cheese there. Cheesing it. I'm cheesing it. I'm gonna go over here, and I'm gonna go. Oh no, no, you thought. Ooh. I love it if it got through the doorway. And I'm gonna go over here, and oh, spider's Boom. dead. This guy. Boom! We did it. We took out the spider. Over here. You did it. You killed it. Now cut me down before anything else shows up. Yes, the claw. I know how it works. The claw, the markings, the door, and the hall of stories. I know how they all fit together. 
Help me down and I'll show you. You won't believe the power the Nords have hidden there. Does it look like I can move? You have to cut me down first. That's a very good point. What do you think is going to happen, Rosie? He's going to betray you. He's going to he's going to harvest your money. <laughs> harvest. Yeah. But while you're cutting him down, should we should we start wrapping up before we're here all night? You fool. Do it. I share the treasure with anyone. Get him. He's going to harvest the treasure. Stop the pirate. Yes. <laughs> I'll take that and your journal. Why would you tell your plan right when you're right next to the person who you just betrayed? Ah. Oh. Anyway, we should start wrapping up the stream. I'm afraid, Rob. No. Oh. I know. I'm I just it. want to play Skyrim. You can play Skyrim off the stream as well, so we could. I'll wrap it up and you just carry on playing it. Like, is right. it, nothing's going wrong. I just want to put the claw in the door because I love when it, it opens. All right, put the claw in the door. Put put that on the stream. <laughs> oh, wait, I forgot. I'm in the Hall of Draugr. Rosie, look. It's, they're like um, white walkers. Can you see them in their crypts? Oh! Ow! You know, mate, I was just sleeping. What did you do that for? Nasty. Nasty they are. Nasties. Horrible. Horrible nasties. Right, well, I'm gonna what, what's the plan? Are we doing gold door and the gold claw in the door or Oh no, Prashima says you're no fun, Mama Rosie! No, I don't wanna be a Mama Rosie! They don't like fire. Draugr. But we could be here all day if <laughs> if we don't put an end to Rob Skyrim ramp. Put an end to him! No! If we don't put an end to him! <laughs> no! Yes! Oh, it's so good! It's just such a good game. Don't stand on that, Rosie. What do you think happens if you stand on that pressure pad? Um, Bad things. You'll get cuddled. Let me tell you. <laughs> Bad things. Very bad things. It's a restless draugr. I should not have gone in with the fire. I should not have gone in with the fire, Rosie. He's looking pretty awesome with that fire around him, though. That was a mistake by me. <laughs> Jeff Stanley says he's ignoring Rosie so hard so he can play. Haha. <laughs> yeah, so I'm, I'm going to have to make a stand because we could be here all night otherwise. Let Rob. me just find a gold door. All right, find the, find the gold claw then. Right, that's, that's the thing. Ash is giggling in the streaming room. Uh, Ash wants to go home. <laughs> Let's just end it. End it because... How far away is the door? I thought it was right there, but I was obviously a bit further on. Ash says go around the corner. Ash knows more about this game than you do, Rob. No, she doesn't. <laughs> <laughs> oh, God. The thing is, it's also survival mode, which is a little bit harder than normal. And now all the Draugr are coming. And I might be in trouble. I don't want to die. Go on. Everyone in the Stephen Reed said, Five more mims, Rosie! Just five more minutes! <laughs> Boom. Right, I'm hidden once again. Blue Planet says, which I really hope is a Resident Evil reference. No! Don't go! So I said it in a Resident Evil Chris Redford voice. Oh. Oh. Well, well, well. That's right. Looks like you made it through. Of course I did. I thought the door was well oh, now. <laughs> Ooh, straight <Blah>. down. Oh. <laughs> 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 I know there's a nasty, restless one hiding in one of these. Whoa. <laughs> 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 Oh, I love him. 
can shoot that fire pot down and it ignites that oil. And then they will burn. And they will burn. That might be a restless one. No. Basic. No arrows equipped! Oh, that's bad, Rosie. That's bad. Oh, no! Get the flame! What's this? Just a regular. Oh, go not going down without a fight. Ooh. I mean, no arrows is bad. Iron arrow, gold. I know there's one hiding in one of these areas. I just want to get the golden claw in the golden door. I wonder if Ash knows where one's hiding, though. I think this might be the golden door room. And no, it's not yet. I have for sure it was literally right there after you cut down Arvel the Swift. Annoying. And so the quest for first it was the quest oh, for this the is cabbage a, this and then is a salt big room. Oh god. <laughs> Josh says Rob's just delaying the end of the stream now, Rosie. <laughs> That's all I'm doing. You're right. Ivor says Rob stalling Pearson. You can you can end it if you like, Rosie. But what about the door? Even Ash is saying, what about the door? You've you've hyped up the door now. Ah. This legendary door. I would like to get to the door. Go on, get to the door. That's go on. I won't I won't say anything more until we get to the door. Get to the door on the seventh floor. Everyone's saying, Rob, run. <laughs> just speed running. Yeah, but I'm playing on survival mode. You can't, I can't just keep, I can't just charge through. Charge. It's harder. And I know there are some difficult draug around here. The difficult draug. And I'm out of arrows, which is bad. I thought I had loads. Mucky Mo says, he knows full well there's no door here. <laughs> <laughs> there is! The door you put the claw in! I just like how it goes in. And you like turn it round, it's like... It's like something off um, Indiana Jones. It's great. Dean Shep, I see what you're saying, and I'm not responding to it, because you're being a rapscallion. <laughs> What's you're, he saying? You're be he's being a cheeky sausage. He's saying... No, I said myself that I wouldn't say it. Ash is laughing. She's read what Dean Shep said. I, I rise above this, this <laughs> attitude. Rob, take your time. <laughs> I know everyone wants to go home. I can't believe there's no arrows equipped. For God's sake. I'm just going to say what Dean Shep said because it's not actually that bad. He was saying about Ash Bandicoot and Parashba the Rashba to trigger me. To trigger me. James Miro says, there is no door here. What is, what is going it's on? It's the flying skull. I've forgotten which is the best way to be going. I think it's through there, but there's a little secret at the bottom, if I remember rightly. Waterfall, that's the rule. There's a waterfall, there's a thing. I'd love it if there were some arrows in it. You don't usually find arrows in chests. To Seven honest. places to find the thing. Oh, I don't want a warhammer. It's really heavy, and I can't really afford to be carrying that. It's 24 weight. No, that'll over-encumber me. Oh, just end the stream, Rosie. Right, what are you calling it? Well, it's home time now, isn't it? <laughs> it's beyond home time now. All right, look around this corner. Okay, what's in this room? And then we'll see. Because it could be the door here. It's not. It's not? All right, No, there's a, whole, there's a whole other cavernous room I've got to get across. All right, well, then I'm really sorry. I'm going to I'm gonna start. Oh, is that the door? No. Oh. It well, leads to the door, though, I think. Although that is a nasty draw, go that. <laughs> she said on PlayStation Access, I'm trapped in the streaming room forever. And we can't leave Ash being trapped. She's waiting to, to wrap up the stream for us. So I'm going to start doing doing the chats whilst Rob slays this restless draug drauger. Drauger. Yes. Drauger, yes. It's Yay, got a big I'm old, learning. It might kill me. There's a very good chance it's going to kill me with that thing that it's got. 
Ash, oh, Ash said we need to find this door. She's not ending until we found the door. So now we're just... That's it, Rob. We're finding this door. Go on. Do it for Ash. Oh. Ugh. I could really do with... Lord from Mud said the door is after this door. This is getting very exciting with this music building up. Apprentice lock, is it? No, other way. Dan Cart says, come on, Rosie, just one more hour. <laughs> I don't want to be a mum. No. <sighs> Gold. I shall find a magic her. Look for the sanctum. Yeah, I'm pretty sure there's another... I am close to it. God, this is such a larger dungeon than I remember. It's literally the first dungeon in the game. <laughs> Beatastic Yoki says, perhaps the door is really the friends we made along the way. I mean, the door's not even that good. It's literally just a door. We look, we're still looking for the door. The door for the gold claw. Oh god, that was really bad. That was really bad. <laughs> oh no. Can't afford to lose any health to this lot. I am doing. Excuse me, do you know where the door for the gold claw is? Oh no. I know where the door for the gold claw is. <laughs> Just come over here and let me tell you. Oh, beautiful. Where's the other one? Oliver Barth says use the healing spell, Rob. Do you need to heal? Yeah, I can use the healing spell. He's right. I should be using that instead. Oh, God. Oh. Oh. Drains Magicka a lot, though, look. I'm not sure how I'm going to fare against the actual boss, but... Um... He's off. I hear, like, a little twinkling. That's my healing magic that I've got equipped. Oh, okay. Jammy B 89 says... There's still a way to go yet. <laughs> yeah, there is. That's the problem. <laughs> oh. Wait, no, here it is! <gasps> this is the door. We have found the door. This is the door I wanted to show you. you know the claw we got off Arvel the Swift. Remember, Rosie? The the what with the Swift? Arvel, the, the, guy, who's, Whoa, the guy who was inside the web, we saved him. Yep. He ran away, he had the claw. And this is what I like about it. You've got to put the claw in there. Right. And open the door. But you're like, oh, what do the symbols mean? And then... And then... And then... And then... And then, and then it's on the end. Oh, bear... Chicken... Oh, look bird... Look <laughs> bird... Bear... bear chicken... And... <laughs> Owl. <laughs> it's bear, <laughs> dragonfly, owl. Yeah. Bear, dragonfly, owl. Bear, dragonfly, owl. I just love this. I love this so much. That's a very Resident Evil puzzle. And the owl. And then you put the the claw in there. How exciting is that? It feels like we're discovering something that no one's seen for thousands of years. Uh huh. Look, we're here in the depths of Bleak Falls Sanctum. We have found the door. An area no one has seen for thousands of years. Move quietly. Let us hope our presence here may go unnoticed. <laughs> Quickly now, it's a four-day journey to the other side. 
That was the door, Ash, yes. They said Ash just said in her voice, was that not the door? Yeah. <laughs> I felt sorry, Ash, I had to repeat it so I could hear what you were saying. The boss is up there. The boss is literally in that coffin up there. Well, maybe we should... Maybe you can fight the boss by the, while we're wrapping up. Let's just wrap up. We're just <laughs> Let's just wrap up. I'll do a little save here. Drop a little save. We found the door! Woo! We did it. What, a, what, a, what an adventurous way to end the stream. We're finding and opening a door. <laughs> finding I, and opening a door. <laughs> I didn't die once. You I didn't? didn't die once. No. You didn't die once. No. You didn't kill anyone. You didn't steal anything technically, but no. you harvested. I did. And you took things, but you didn't steal. And what I would do now is I'd run all the way back to the bed at the beginning of the dungeon and level up is what I would do. Um, so that's why I'm not going to do that now because that would take forever. <laughs> <laughs> that's stream goes on for another half an hour. I'll do that at home. But uh, either way, everyone, thank you all so much for joining us. I've had a blast watching uh, Skyrim, well, Rob play Skyrim on survival mode. Like I said, I don't know anything, but like, I hardly know anything about this, so this has been an absolute delight to see. Rob, have you been having fun? I mean, you always have fun. This Loads is a stupid question. Loads of fun. Look at that big wall. It's like dragonborn language written on that, and I learn a dragon shout from it. Oh. That's cool. Look at this place. Doesn't it just fill you with wonder? It does. I'm feeling lots of wonder right now. But I can't have this feeling of wonder, I'm afraid, anymore. Because we have to wrap up. Because poor Ash is waiting to go home. But thank you all so much for watching. Thank you so much to Oliver, Domino, and Alex for being wonderful moderators for us on this stream. Please stay tuned to the channel because we have loads more wonderful content coming up for you. Rob's taken a lovely screenshot there. Please share that on Twitter so you can become Twitter famous. And um, I already am Twitter famous. <laughs> but more Twitter famous. Oh, Ash just oh. said get verified, Rob. <laughs> oh. uh, and, there, and I'm going to now say we're going to put onto the screen. So I'm going to do the awkward wave. And thank you all for watching. Bye, everyone. Bye. Bye.